Hello everybody, welcome to my channel, Super Sam 7, and today I'm reviewing The Flash Volume 1 Lightning Strikes Twice. Now this was The Flash in DC Rebirth era. This has the first 8 issues of the series, and it's this button right here if you want to look at it. And yeah, this is the first appearance of Godspeed. Now for the first time, I had no idea Godspeed first appeared in 2017, or whenever DC Re Re Rebirth started. I thought it was around... Uh, right before Flashpoint for some reason. I have no idea why, but anyway, you can see him right here. It's Godspeed, the villain of Godspeed's first appearance. Most people probably know of him of the Fla from the Flash TV show. Definitely a fan favorite because he is so fast because he has stolen the Speed Force from other members who got it. Because what happens is uh, in this story, a giant speed storm comes to Central City. And it hits a bunch of people and they get super speed like the Flash. And Godspeed secretly has gone around. August Hart has gone around and stolen their speed. And if the speedster didn't give it up willingly, they died when he stole their speed. And he was able to because he was faster than them. Um, so yeah. And as Mina, the Flash's new girlfriend, I guess, he becomes and then she disappears. I don't know what happens next. And at the end, Godspeed is his goal is to kill all the Flash villains in Iron Heights, but the Flash stops him by seemingly taking away his speed. He gets captured, or knocking him out, and he gets captured in Iron Heights prison. He tells the Flash about this uh, group that goes after Speed Force weaponry called Black Hole. They were kind of the start of this story, and uh, he decides not to tell Barry the full truth or details about it. Anyway. I kind of want to really talk about the villain, the villain organization Black Hole. They just use flash weaponry, and there's a moment where he becomes a giant speed force monster, and the team running around him super fast. Him, Mina, and uh, Godspeed. He doesn't really pick out a name until he becomes Godspeed right in front of the Flash, and they defeat him. And he kind of goes into a comatose state at Iron Heights. Wally West from DC New Fifty Two is in here, and he has super speed still. But at the very start, Wally West, the original Kid Flash, the one who wears the yellow suit, and from, you know, the Young Justice cartoon, he returns. I don't really know much about this Flash stuff, can, you know, in continuity outside of Flashpoint, so he grabs Wally West from pre-Flashpoint. Uh, he talks to Batman for, like, two pages about the Watchmen crossover, or at that point, they just knew about the smiley face button. Um... So the big stuff here, there's murders, Barry Allen is the CSI crime scene investigator, and anyway, his best friend August Hart works with him as a police officer, but the thing is, his brother, or his, yeah, I think it was his little brother who was, oh gosh, can't let I remember, I read this a few days ago, sorry guys. Yeah, his brother was killed, and the murderer who was, or the guy who was suspected of being the murderer just got the walk away with it. And so he wants revenge and he kills the guy who got away. But it turns out that he was wrong at the very end. That he just killed an innocent man. But anyway. Godspeed doesn't really appear in person until the end of the issue 4 I think. Let me try and find it. Or the start of issue 4. Or And right here. Look at that. He looks awesome after he kills three prisoners who got the speed force. And they committed a crime while doing it. While using their speed. There's one... Issue in here that has Wally West, the new 52 Wally West train, he uses powers again. Uh, God's, what is it, Godspeed shows up and he kills, or he takes some people's force. And the thing is, he moves so fast that it looks like, uh, uh August Hart in his, co his made-up costume isn't Godspeed, because he can be at two places at once with his power. Which I think was actually really smart for him to do with Godspeed, was make him... I will steal other speedsters powers because of the speed storm that, that came in Central City. What I really like about Godspeed here is he is not a full on supervillain in the most evil way. He actually stops crimes and kills villains and he just leaves people to, to do their own thing basically. And he didn't really want to kill those speedsters who wouldn't give him his speed. It just happened, you know. So it was definitely one of the most interesting it was definitely a good addition to the Flash's Rogues Gallery because I mean, there is a lot to him. Where is it where he transforms into Godspeed? Right here. Look at that picture. I don't really like the art that much, but when it comes to the fight scenes and action scenes, oh my gosh, it is glorious. 
Now, I will have some critique that I think this book and stories, they should have been a little bit longer because out of nowhere, the Flash just accuses August Hart of committing the, the murder that Godspeed did when he when Godspeed killed the uh, uh, innocent guy who returned, uh, the guy he thought killed his brother. And he just reveals everything to Flash automatically at that conver- at that confer- confrontation. Iris West didn't really do anything. She was kind of annoying in this story, though. But I guess it's just they're leaning into her being a reporter. I know that there's an omnibus coming out. I probably would rather get that if you don't have any of the volumes. Yeah, I think I have volumes 1 through 11 of this run for the Flash or the DC Rebirth Flash. Yeah, that picture was when he was going to kill um the Flash, all the Flash rogues in Iron Heights, including Professor Zoom, which I'm kind of annoyed. They call him Professor Zoom, not Reverse Flash, but I know that's a new 52 thing. And yeah, that was Wally West returning as as the Flash. With that said, any comparison to the Flash TV show? I didn't really watch the show after season 5. I'm pretty sure she's in season 7, and she's like Reverse Flash's girlfriend before Reverse Flash turns evil. I know Godspeed is in it, but he's not really done well, if I remember again. Uh, here's the leader of Black Hole, or one of the leaders. Apparently, he's not the real boss. That's what Godspeed knows. But, anyway. This was a great story. I read it in, like, less than two days. Definitely has Godspeed live up to his name, and the hype around Godspeed is not enough, because he is an awesome supervillain. Alright, with that said, thank you for watching, and have a great day.